Today I'm going to be trying to make a box or some kind of structure to hold our batteries. So we have these two beefy 300 amp batteries. We got two of them. Um, I don't want to just lay them down here because we'll lose a lot of space. So what I'm trying to do is utilize some of this area above the wheel well. So I'm going to make a structure to just cover this area and then stack the batteries on top here. Since um, the width is pretty much the same width as the wheel well. So one battery should be able to sit on top here and then one, one will be right there. Okay, I think I've made uh, enough modifications to this. I've added some extra support braces underneath um, for this overhang. So that way, just in case um, this um, were to crack, at least it has some structural support underneath it. But yeah, so far so good. Now I can start um, planning out and seeing where I want to place things. Um, underneath here I'm probably just gonna screw them directly to that our distribution panel all set up uh, and the nice thing about this is all of our wiring is um, hidden behind this little box and so all we have to do if we want to add a fuse is uh, make sure we pop this out put the wiring through connect it and then we can just add our fuses here so I have all of our DC fuses connected here I still need to buy fuses for our AC appliances but that will all I have to do is just pop this out, install the fuses. I have the wires behind there. Um, but yeah, this is like a nice, sleek distribution box for our wires. And everything's set up here. Um, one thing I need to do is configure our um, inverter charger so that way it properly charges our batteries to the specifications that the uh, manufacturer provided but I'll do that today but yeah this is our whole setup um, of course the plates off of that but it's really it's looking really nice and I have this box that I'm gonna use to cover the batteries um, to give it some nice insulation 